about the appointment of uh, Ross St. Jack as the head of the uh, civil service. I mean, all this appointment, appointment, and this, you know, that's not even the main thing we are we are after in this country. Is the person you are appointed, she the person get guesses, she the person get brain. Now, we think they find be that river state governor Seminalai Fuba has expressed his appreciation to uh, President Balatinobu for uh, appointing Dame Didi Esther Wilson Jack as the new head of civil service for the Federation. Fuba also commended her with the new head of service of the Federation, not only for being a trailblazer but also for breaking the glass ceiling, breaking the glass ceiling as an ambassador of river state and of the Niger Delta region. Uh, he noted that throughout a uh, remarkable career in the civil service, she has been culminating in an appointment as a permanent secretary in 2017. She has demonstrated exemplary um, leadership, a high level of integrity, courage, perseverance, and resilience. All these things are those cap. Can the person deliver? That's our. That's what we are after. Uh, our beloved president has come again. Uh, and that speaker has come to come and speak for him. Uh, Tinimbo means well, means, means well for the youth, says by um, Sunday as 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 the senior special assistant to the president on student engagement as on Sunday on Tuesday called on uh, all Nigerian youths to be patient with the president administration. Sunday made the appeal in Makodi while speaking with journalists during a three-day capacity building and leadership development training program. He says that uh, I'm calling on youth to be patient with the gov government of President Bola Tinubu because the president means well for them. They should not allow enemies of the state to use them because there are a lot of people whose policies and programs of this government do not tally with theirs. I mean, uh, yeah, like I said in the last, uh, I mean, in my last review on Tinubu, all these statements should have uh, visible backups. We shall have visible backups. He's coming and urging youths that we should. Last time it was that we should calm down, that we should try and pass away the, the pain. And now he's coming, another person is coming again to tell us that Tinubu means well for the youths. I keep saying these are not the things that we. These are not all these programs, yes, they can empower us, but words without action is, is just it's useless. It's very, 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 very useless. And he also says that the capacity building is aimed to engage students' leaders and to train them on conflict resolution management that will enhance their leadership capacity in the future. They are just using, that's what they were doing the last time, just using this to cover up for some months now. They will call on powerful programs that will bring you together so it to be like they've done something good. Whereas they've, no, they've, not, they've not fixed anything. And by the time they do that, it will brainwash or slam level say, or it will brainwash. Um, so mute again, like the way it always happen, yeah, like the way it always it's always happening. To bring watch them again, by the time you know it now, everything will, will, will say back to normal. But suffering will not be normal for us. So suffering cannot be normal for me. It cannot be normal. Things go back to every way until something big comes up again. Now, they will protest again. It's just a, just a, just a, just a rough cycle, a wrong cycle actually. The foundational problem right here is the government and we need to fish them out we need to fish out the bad eggs we need to break and destroy the bad eggs what am i saying we need to break and destroy them so we can have a better nigeria and guys don't forget to subscribe like and hit on the notification button bell uh, that bell or button so you can always know what's up thank you